Now, it's a year since a survivor of the Manchester Arena bombing successfully climbed Kilimanjaro in an adapted mountain trike. Martin Hibbert was paralysed in the terrorist attack and was determined that his injuries wouldn't stop him completing the extreme climb. Today, he donated the chair that helped him get to the top to a woman from Leeds who also has big dreams. I went to meet them both this morning. When I reached the summit, I'd only just come out of intensive care five years earlier. Life looked, you know, very bleak. It was an amazing feeling and to do it as a, a paraplegic, something I will never forget. 12 months ago, Martin Hibbert, severely injured in the Manchester Arena bombing, reached the summit of Kilimanjaro. The journey was made possible by a team of supporters and one very special mountain trike. It's basically rather than pushing with uh, the, the wheels, you push in with a, a push and pull motion and that puts you forward. Uh, so there's like a chain on it. It will literally glide over all terrain. So it's, it's an amazing bit of engineering. Now Martin wants to help others reach their goals. And today he's giving his trike away to Emma Kaywood from Leeds, who won a competition run by the Spinal Injuries Association. I was uh, paralysed uh, three and a half years ago, yeah, just as we went into lockdown. I haven't been able to sort of go out with my family on dog walks. I haven't been able to go with my son who loves to go mountain biking to be able to just go with him. I have had this dream for a while now to go up Snowdon um, and in this chair it wouldn't be possible. This is going to be life changing. My world is just going to open up. It will take time and training to get used to the all-terrain capabilities of the mountain trike. But for Emma, new adventures and Snowden await. Uh, the best bits is how fast it can go and the places it can go. It was going over rocks and the grass and everything. Um, it's a bit scary when it breaks fast because it tips, but I'm now used to it and I know I'm not going to tip out, um, but it's absolutely brilliant. I love it.